Bob, how have you seen young adults change over the years? I think the world has changed. I don't think teenagers have as much. Because deep down, they're still kids, you know. But today, they're more at risk. Uh, they've got cars at 16 and want to go get going. Obviously, there are drugs. Uh, and everything is more accessible. You know, we were good kids in my generation, but we didn't have a chance not to be. <laughs> we, we didn't have the, you know, the wherewithal to do it. it. It was depression. We didn't have the money. My father never had a car until the 60s. And we didn't have a telephone until my high school years. So, it, you know, the good kid today that makes it, you've got to give them a great, great handshake because it's tough growing up today. But on the other hand, the emotions of being a teenager are timeless. I find the adolescent years intriguing to write about because you've got kids with raw emotions and you put them in perilous situations and you've got all the stuff of drama.